Hi, welcome to Carol World. And it looks like Carmine's coming to visit, maybe. Anyway, welcome back. We hope you guys are staying home and staying safe. In the meantime, there's a couple of quickie things I want to remind you of. First of all, there's a GoFundMe page for the Raise the Roof for Paul Henry's Art Gallery. And uh, I put a special link on my website, welcome to carolworld.com. So you can go right to it and take you right to the GoFundMe. And just remember, no dollar donation is too small. We all love Paul Henry's Art Gallery and we're all hoping to really support this effort. The and another thing is, is the upcoming B Show, Because We Care. We designed a coloring book uh, that were graciously donated by 12 Slack artists. And I designed a 5 by 7 little pocket flip book coloring book. And they just launched and they're now available. And they're also on uh, for sale on the website. Include shipping. I'll ship it right to you. And so go on to welcome to carolworld.com for that. And so enough marketing and whatnot. So let me get to a piece that I just wrote this week and it's called N95. The tiny fingers stretched upwards, gently tracing the deep grooves, the discoloration and deep bruising, a rapid reply to the day's doings. Salted tear edged off the corner. Mommy, you're injured. Ears still echoing, the incessant plunge, vacuums, suctions, and cries of despair. But now, the world became real once more. It's okay, dear. Mommy's fine. The drive of decompression exhaling the day, preparation to separate the day from night, knowing her soft place to fall, another hurdle. The horn hawks, her day set in, proceeding through the traffic, again drawing air deep and wide. Mile after mile, distracted by interlopers, corner mobs and placards, impatience running amok wanting to balance it out, wanting to stop and plead, wanting to explain safety over privilege. She stands in the shower, praying the day would leach out, spilling into the abyss. Towel wrapped, skin glistening, her eye caught by the steaming mirror, sad eyes to the stranger reflected. Welcome back with soft hands. Her husband kisses her softly, fearing he now sees the new stranger. It's an abstract in my head. Coffee steaming, birds alight with song, but this is real. Merely a day in her life. Morning breaks with scrubs redress. She's out before her child awakes. As her ship changes, my abstract courses with cortisol. I'm unable to fathom another tear. Mommy's going to be fine. I'm not sure, but without her, life would surely be more grave.